Jeez. Let's go. She's still here, waiting for some TLC. Let's put that down there. I'm going to put my cup of tea here. Bought some of these paper suits. everywhere treading it in the house so keep the fiberglass off me my arms were itching all right let's crack on Mask. Got the mask. Ah. Yeah, yeah, it's good. So it's beautiful You gotta wear a mask sand in this uh fiberglass down. Oh the smoly. We got out of the boat and it's here. Would you believe it? Would you add them in either? Back on with a bit more of this sanding. People just sell shit. What the hell? Only had it a week. Come on, you fucking bitch. Trying to line all them bloody holes up. Mm. It's hot and dusty in here. I'm gonna open the door. There's some fresh air in. That's better. Uh, some shining. Fiberglass into there. Back 
to tear it down the edges and then it's like a, a feather edge finish. Uh, so I just like to get this uh, done first and then that way. Um, I have to mess about when I mix the resin. Well, got this fiberglass in to do here. Uh, it's not a weak point or anything, it's just where I think they've had a door across here. So it's a bit untidy the way they've left it. So I just thought I'd get a nice surface uh, for the painting and uh, it'll cover it over the mess they've made so it's just a matter of tidying it up I'm just go and get my rubber gloves right let's turn you around this for a... see these are ceramic pots I'll mix the hardener in here and you know it doesn't stick to it so when you finish with your brush leave it in and you can pull it out like a lollipop uh, and then use it again so you don't have to keep buying paper cups for mixing your, your resin in right you've got to give it a shake you always give it a good shake This is good stuff. Try sell. Uh, Lloyd's approved resin. Polyester. Good stuff. I've got a good dollop in there. I don't want to run out. And I do this. Right. Hardener. I get out of shape. Right. You've got to mix it well. You find that it's getting red hot quick and smoking, you put the too much hardener in. Put a bit of resin on here first. Get the air out of it. Start in the middle and push your way out. Okay. Yeah, I thought you don't drag it out. Gentle taps. Work your way out to the edges. Like that. This piece in here. Look at that. Keep wetting it. It'll go transparent. Side. 
this bloody woman singing on here. You mad in? The BBC want you to have a license to listen to this crap. I think they're taking the piss. Right. Show sure that's all in the nooks and crannies. See any white spots see your fiberglass. Otherwise you've not got enough resin on it. Right, nice gentle taps now. Make your way out. Into the air. What? What's that piece? <coughs> This piece in here now. You always have to make with this resin, you don't make too much, otherwise, you're wasting it. You can run out before you actually finish the job. to the edges. Well I sound like an expert don't I? I've been watching Andy on the boat works on YouTube. I'm only quoting him. That's where I'm learning from. Uh, it's not like I uh, done this before. This is the first fiberglass in I've done in my life so it seems to be working all right when it dries there's no hurry well we're getting there slowly it's not a job that you can rush uh, just been putting that on dolphin glaze it's an ultra fine uh, finish filler so I've sand all the fiberglassing down and I've just put a bit of dolphin glaze over the top just feather edged it in uh, you sand that back with 240 when it's dry so a few little bibs and bobs just a bit round here. Put a bit on this corner. Some tiny little dimples of uh, fiberglass that so yeah, a little bit on the front of the hull the hull there. Uh, only scratches but I thought I'd fill them in anyway. Sand them back, fill them in. Oh it's missed a little bit there. <coughs> I'll do that later. Put a bit on this nose here, but I'll have to build that up in uh, two lots and then I'll go over it all so knock it back then. Same with here. Got a little bit here I could fill in there, a bit of crack in the fiberglass. Only a little crack, but may as well fill it in. Yeah, it's coming along step by step. I'm going to have to remember and remind myself, you know, I think it was made in the late 50s. So it's not it's not going to look like a bay liner finish. <laughs> but you need a bit of character in it, don't you? You know, things get scratched on the trailer. It's not going to be 110%. 
with a mirror finish, finish but it's going to be tidy it'll look nice uh, obviously there's going to be a couple of little marks here and there that'll show through but uh, that's the character of the boat used and worn as long as it doesn't leak it doesn't sink as long as it floats no water's coming in anywhere and the buoyancy is good uh, not a lot more you can ask for but I'll take my time and uh, get it to the best I can you'll have little scratches here hopefully the paint will cover them up proper marine paint I've got you know for below the water line so I'll give it maybe three coats four coats or as much as I can use the paint up if it takes six coats I'll give it six coats if there's enough paint there's no point keeping all of it if I'm gonna sell the boat <sighs> yeah well, the project actually is going to fund towards a, a thermal telescopic site which is the ATN uh, thermal LT scope which is 4B8 mag uh, got a thermal handheld spotter which is an XQ38F which is awesome um, I get the scope which will be great It'd be great for shooting rats around the barns. It won't be like that then, will they? So the dolphin glazers uh, is getting the shape back now on the edge here for the boat. A bit too sharp, just need to knock that edge off. It's got the look, it's got the look. Well, it's coming on, I'm pleased. A lot of sanding to do. That uh, peeling are coming through. <coughs> yeah. Put dolphin glaze over the fiberglass here. So that's got to be knocked back. <laughs> It'll be lovely and smooth then. Nice surface for painting. Uh, had to build this corner up with a bit of fiberglass because that uh, crack was a little bit deep. I took it back to the fiberglass, put a new fiberglass piece in, dolphin glaze on top, reshape that, smooth it off, and uh, yes, baby, where do you want to be?